Hi, my name is Deborah Gerson. I've been uh, working with ACE for a while. I'm also a sociologist and I used to be a nurse. Now, I'm going to talk a little bit about what, what housing means and really have us think about it. We've chosen as our themes for this action housing justice, home security. Say that again. Housing justice, home security. Housing justice, home security. Often people think of housing as one part of people's basic needs, like food, clothing, and shelter. Uh -huh. Certainly, housing is what shelters us from the elements, keep us warm when it's cold, and dry when it's rain, when it's raining. And when I talk to classes about what home means, often people talk about love and community. Certainly, these are important. But there are other, even more basic needs that housing meets that we sometimes forget. For many, for more than, I don't know, 20, 30, 40, 50 years, American people have been struggling to get some, uh, some of their health care costs insured. Right. You know, in ways that all nations around the world, developed nations, have uh, publicly funded health care. And we support that struggle. It's yes. basic. But actually, the first line of defense for all our health is uh, is a home. You That's can't right. be healthy if you don't have a home. Say that. Yeah. Right. No home, no health. No okay. home, no health. And, and, and the, the first line of defense for children, for elders, for all of us. At home we are out of the rain and the cold. At home we can rest and get the sleep we need. At home we may be drinking hot tea or cool water as we need. At home, we take the medicines or over-the-counter drugs we may use. That's right. Home health care, well care, and sick care requires a home. That's right. For all of us who have raised children or built children, we know that most taking care of sick kids happens at home. That's right.